she's a woman, she's all by herself out here, and it's like, wow, you know, that takes a lot of courage to do. Every time we hear a story about her, we cry because we know there's something driving her. The woman walking that far, who, who wouldn't want to witness that? Who wouldn't want to be a part of that, right? I don't know what's true and what's not true. We are talking about the mysterious woman in black. A mysterious figure dressed in black. When I saw her from behind, I started crying in my vehicle and I said, I can't believe it's her. <laughs> I mean, it's just very emotional seeing her. You, you don't even think about it, you just, I, I, I can't explain it. <laughs> when you see a woman like this, it gives you hope and it makes you feel good. Yeah, so why can't we feel that? Why can't we feel that every once in a while? What is wrong moment. with that? Instead of all the bad stuff, feel, yeah. what's wrong with something good? I think the mystery makes it more interesting. And that's why everybody on Facebook is talking about it, the news stations. The social media got so big and they just wanted to be a part of what was going on with everybody else. I find her inspiring because most people would never make a journey like this. For anybody to do that, it, it takes a, a, a very strong will. That, that's great in today's society. Deaf people have begun tipping water over their heads to pretend that Arabs and Jews are natural enemies. We know the limitations of a social media campaign. I am 21 years old and I'm a blogger on YouTube.